So team, today I'm gonna to be taking you to the top five bags that I'm gonna be using all throughout spring and summer. I'm also gonna explain why I chose these bags and also when I like to use them. Also, just a little heads up, uh, almost all of these are tote bags. So to, to, to be honest, that should just be no surprise by now. This video is also in partnership with Karma, which is formerly known as ShopTagger, which is an app slash Chrome extension tool, which ensures that you never miss a price drop or coupon code. So definitely check the link below. For now, let's get into bag number one. So starting off with bag number one, obviously it has to be the Reigns tote bag. For any of the OGs out there, you'll know that I've had this bag for quite some time and I definitely rate it, especially for the price point. Now, depending on where you get it from, it can roughly come in between 30 and 40 pounds. I'll put a few uh, different links uh, in the description box down below for you lot as well. Now, there are a few reasons why this is my top five, but the biggest reason is the fact that it is waterproof slash water resistant and when you live in a place like london like i do even if it's spring or summer it still rains a lot so having like a bag that you know will protect your stuff mainly like my laptop is the main thing that goes in here it does kind of give me that like peace of mind now this tote bag does come in a few different colorways but for me black is kind of just like the key one to go for because I just find it can look good with just a casual outfit, but then if you are wearing something a bit more dressed up, it doesn't look out of place either. But yeah, definitely rate this one the most. So bag number two is one I use pretty much every single time I go out to do like a photo shoot now, and that's because it holds so much stuff. Like literally, I can put two like full outfits in this bag, my camera and, and even a tripod. And by the way, when I said two outfits, that's including shoes. And that is this Prada nylon tote bag and i was actually able to get this for 60 percent off and that was from using karma so you will know i've been using karma again formerly known as shop tagger for such a long time now and it saved me so much money over the years again this tote bag right here it saved me about 600 pounds so there are three main features that i find super useful with karma the first one is that when you see an item that you like all you have to do is click the karma button and then you can set your preferences so Karma can send you a notification via email or mobile whenever this item goes on sale, has a relevant coupon code, or comes back in stock. It's really nice to be able to actually save your items into multiple wish lists, which for me, it actually helps me like shop more mindfully and then kind of like have less impulsive buys. The second main feature that I love is the coupon codes. What Karma does is that they scan the entire internet for any coupon codes and they will apply them automatically at checkout. And thirdly is their cashback feature, which allows you to earn cash back via PayPal when you shop from selected retail partners, which pretty much just means you save even more money. So team, if you do any form of online shopping, definitely check them out. I'll have a link in the description box down below so back to this Prada bag now like I said this holds just so much stuff which is a necessity for me but the struggle I've had like over my times of let's say shooting and whatnot is I've always found in the past I'll have to take like a massive backpack and stuff with me which if you guys remember I used to well, I still do have it the big kind of like yellow north face backpack which it's still a great bag, but it's not something I want when I'm, you know, going around like the city, like shooting outfits and stuff like that. I really wanted to have like a tote bag like this, which is a very decent size that still looks like it fits, you know, the outfit. Like I want to feel like when I go out and I've packed two outfits in here, I've got a camera, I've got a tripod, that when I'm actually styling it still, like it just works with the outfit. So that's why this one is a must for me. So coming into bag number three, and finally, it's not a tote bag. It is the Acne Studio Art Mini Cross Body Bag. Now, I was kind of deciding between this one and if you guys remember, I have that Prada Cross Body Bag. But for me, this is the one that I feel I gravitate to a lot more now. What I really like about this is it's, it's subtle. It's just a nice little kind of extra piece to have on you and, you know, like an accessory to just kind of like add a little bit more detail to your outfit because as you all know, when it comes into more summertime, it gets quite hard to add layers without overheating. And I feel this just does a great job at kind of just, you know, adding a little, like I said, a bit more detail to your outfit. Now, the size is still pretty good in here. Like I can fit my, my phone, my wallet, my keys, lip balm, um, AirPod. So it's just nice to have a cross you. I don't have to have anything in my pocket. All right, bag number 14. Again, a tote bag, a massive 
<laughs> a big canvas tote bag and this was from Studio Nicholson and it is 25 pounds. I've had my eye on this for such a long time, such a long time. Now, the reason why I just never picked it up is because I just didn't want to order it online because then you had to pay for shipping and stuff as well. And for 25 pounds, it just, it wasn't worth, you know, then paying it was like eight pound shipping or something like that. So I waited for the stores to open up in the UK because we've kind of just come out of our like main lockdown period. And I went to Studio Nicholson store and finally picked it up. Now this is massive. It is massive. Um, because it is canvas, it's not the type of bag that I'm gonna put like too much valuable stuff in there because um, it's, it's not gonna be that secure or anything like that. But this is like my bag that if I'm going to the gym and things like that, and then I'm going out for the rest of the day, this is definitely the bag that I like to use. The reason why I like canvas tote bags as well so much is that you can obviously just fold them up to literally nothing. And for 25 pounds, I think it's a really good bag. And last, but certainly not least, the one that you've probably seen on my Instagram the most is this amazing kind of like vibrant electric blue tote bag from Acne Studios. Now, again, you've seen me style it so much. I absolutely love this. This is why it's in my top five. I feel it's a great way to add color to your outfit, especially in like spring and summertime. For someone like me who doesn't wear too much color, this tote bag just allows me to add that like vibrant pop of color. This one actually holds quite a bit of stuff as well. However, because the stitching of the bag, like of the handles just goes in at the top here. I don't tend to like to put like too much heavy stuff in there. For example, like my laptop and my camera, uh, just because I am aware that the stitching could come undone. If you look at like the Reigns tote bag, and if you do want a heavy duty kind of like tote bag, this is what you should look out for, is when the strapping itself goes actually around the bag instead of just connecting at the top. When it goes around, it's a lot more secure and it can take back a bit more of a load. But yeah, this bag is definitely more of an accessory. It's obviously, it has its functional aspects. Again, I can just put gym gear in here and stuff as well, but it is a lot more of an accessory. And like I said, a way for me to add kind of just a pop of color to my outfit. And there we have it team. Those are my top five favorite bags that I'll be using throughout spring and summer. I'll make sure I put a link to each of these bags in the description box down below. And remember that spring slash summer sales are either happening now or about to start to happen. So keep an eye out for these bags because you will probably see a few of them on sale. Also team, don't forget to download Karma. I'll have a link in the description box down below for you. Other than that team, enjoy the rest of your day, keep dressing well, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.